actress and the daughter of one of the greatest civil rights leaders in history. That's right. And her young co-star has graced us with award-winning performances time and time again. And they're currently starring together in the ABC movie called Selma, Lord Selma. Take a look at this. Miss Bright, I understand what Dr. King talks about. You do? Freedom. And what does freedom mean? Doing stuff you want to. It's more complicated than that, Cheyenne. And voting. Can you vote? You get back to your lessons and leave these things for older people. Will you please welcome Yolanda King and Journey Small? How are you? Oh, no. How it's a cute! Pleasure. That's a oh, pleasure. I like Thank you. you. I like you too. Okay. Welcome to the show. We're just gonna stay like it's this. It's a love okay. fest. It's a love fest. <laughs> How sweet you are. Journey, what a cute name. I love that name. That is cute. Yeah. Journey. I like it too. It's like there's this story behind it of how I, when my mommy was going through labor with me, I took a nap for two hours. And the doctors were thinking something was wrong with me, but my mommy understood that I was still alive. And that, um, so I came down exactly two hours later with the contractions um, less than a minute apart. And my mommy said it was a trip to have me, so she named me Journey. Oh, that's great. That's great. That's a good story. You're done having an app. Get me out of here. You know, speaking, speaking of journeys, what a journey you had having. Uh, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. as a father. Mm. How, what was that like growing up with a, such a, a powerful figure mm. as, as your dad? Well, you know, because my parents really downplayed what they were doing and the work and so forth and the importance of it, we figured he was just kind of like a normal guy that people went to jail just like a bus driver goes to drive a bus. Our father went to jail. Oh, come on. <laughs> you know? Are you serious? No, he really did. He, wow. she, she really, my mother successfully managed to keep it, keep us real regular and really normal to create this as much of a normal existence as possible. Now, we certainly knew that daddy was special. Yes. And there was attention and focus on him. I remember the first time I went to an event where people were pulling on him and wanting to touch him. And right. I was like, why are these people touching my daddy? Get away from my daddy. Get away. But, but there was not the, the, the danger. She was able to keep the danger away from her. My mother is just incredible. Was, yeah. was he the same way? in your home as he was perceived by people? Oh, no, not really? at all. He was, he was a jokester in, in our home. He was my first buddy. That's Taught cool. me to swim when I was four. We'd romp in the house, play ball, go to the amusement park, ride all the dangerous, scary rides. And no, he was, he loved to laugh. That's and great. we spent a lot of time laughing. Oh, that's so nice. Hey, Journey. Yeah. You know, in this movie that the, we just saw a clip of, you play a very brave girl mm, yeah, in uh, yeah. Summer Lord Summer. Yeah, I met Cheyenne, and um, I, I felt very honored to play such a, of a strong girl. I mean, at my age, to have that much strength, I thought it was so amazing. I was surprised that they hadn't publicized this story hmm. as much as everything else How old was. is Cheyenne now? She, it's got to be in her 40s, right. somewhere yeah. around there. Yes, early yeah. 40s. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Why do you think it's so important for families to watch this together? Oh, it's the show. It's vitally important. First of all, young people think this happened like ancient. It's ancient history to them. You know, a little boy came up to me and asked me once he knew who I was. He asked me why wasn't I dead? You know, I mean, he was, he was about six years old. So for children to be able to see, no, it was not that long ago. Right. And also, young people played a part. They took a stand. They had some power. I mean, I think it's a very empowering, very hopeful production. And maybe some people will go vote. I think you about know, voting if, the if next time anything, afterwards. If it does anything but that, that you've really yeah, accomplished a lot. Yeah. You know, you've been acting for quite some time now in, in the acting business. And you have yeah. two journeys. No, yeah. this is the I've, veteran. The veteran yeah, is right she here. Is ten veteran. months old. You've been yeah. on a You asked when you were ten months? Yeah. Well, I did like modeling. I didn't like being a commercial or nothing. I started my first acting job when I was three, and I was still <laughs> nursing at the time. I didn't stop nursing until I was like over five years old. <laughs> really? 
That's amazing. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> but no, I, I want. <laughs> since you've been acting a long time, <laughs> where do we take that one? Right, okay. Okay. <laughs> so, so I have a question. You've done all these shows. You've been in like Eve's Bayou, all these different shows. When did you know you were a big star? Well, I, I knew I was big when I was able to get Nancy Wilson on the phone. I mean, look at this woman. She oh, is love so Nancy Wilson. Oh, oh, these are for you guys. Oh, you're oh, you're yeah, yeah, yeah. I brought it for you. The show, we got to remind everybody, the show Here's Selma Lord Selma is on ABC January 17th. That's right. At 7 to 9 p.m. You know what? Yolanda, thank you so much. I want Journey, really thank you worth for being seeing. on. It's a wonderful show. Oh, yeah, me. And it's such a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you for being on. We'll be right back right after this. Don't go away. What do squished pennies, toilet seats, and jello have in common? Find out next.